Greetings and welcome back to Ark. And of course, we are on the Lost Island and you can see that I've even gotten a shave and a haircut for this because today is a momentous occasion. We will be making our first foray into the Scorched Earth continent. Basically, it's a huge island, so I'm just calling it a continent for now. But it is going to be the first time that I've traveled there and I do have a plan. All right, first things first, you can see that the structure here is pretty much complete. And as I said I was going to do, I have myself a little landing pad here. And uh, I have a new friend here. This is Joy. She's actually level 445. Oops, I spoke too soon. 446. Okay, just happened upon her, and she really likes teaching these, even though I do think that Fred is just a little bit uh, higher level, so he's looking at me like, why am I in this class? I'm advanced for this. Well, you know, you might just learn something, you know? Okay, so they're up here right now, and of course, our other flyer is over there, and uh, you might notice that um, there's a lot of big dudes over there. I should say, big ladies. Okay, so what we're going to do is, first things first, we do have two new friends. One of them is an addition to an army that we're going to be using, but the other is new. Somebody made the suggestion that I should look for one of these, and I kind of did, but then when I researched it, I was like, oh, that's right, they're in the snow areas. So we have dun, 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 Donna, the Deodon. All right, so here's the story about Donna. So I went with Bernadette and I was searching through the, uh, the ice area, right? And I must have been like 45 minutes an hour. First of all, they're very rare. The first two I found were like level 50 and level 60. And I'm like, no, no, no. About half an hour later, and I mean that, about a half an hour later, I found um, a 60 and a 190. And I'm thinking, okay, you know what? I've already been doing this for more than half an hour. The 190 sounds fine. And then it ran in and attacked a rather large T-Rex. And I'm like, okay, well, that's done. A little bit more searching, and I found a pack of four of them, right? And they were just running right to a, um, a woolly rhino. And there was two 40s, a 60, and a 260. And I'm like, okay, and they're all packed together, and they're all fighting. And I'm like, okay, I'm just going to grab them one at a time until I get the one I want. So I swooped down, grabbed one, flew up. Looked down, and I saw 40, 40, 60. I got on the first shot, and as a result, we have Donna, who is actually very close now. Hold on a second here. Where is it? Um, um, I would boost food, except I'm not a masochist. Okay, she is the one creature that I have that has mutton. And, by the way, the food, notice how utterly enormous it is. You turn on her healing ability, and it just vanishes. It's all vanishing. I have, I've had dinosaurs going out and killing things just to keep her fed because the food just vanishes. Ooh. But she is actually really useful. I was having a lot of trouble with the T-Rexes because especially the newer ones is that, you know, they would have like 9,000 health, but... They could have up to like in the 70s. So it's like they're dying, you know. It's just, you're standing on one of them. The whole screen is pulsating because it has so little health in comparison to its maximum. And uh, actually Conan. Hold it a second. Boom. Here, hold it a minute. Uh, we do have some new ones. By the way, I did check the names here. This is uh, first things first. This is the one you know. This is Valentina. She was our first. And since then, we've done another, so another little breeding here. This is Marika. She's higher level. Don't think about it. Just don't think about it, really. All right, so where's Conan? Conan is over here. Okay, Conan now has 125,000 health. So obviously, that was taking a very long time to increase. And he's got 3,170 in terms of the... Uh, melee damage so he's kind of formidable there right there and uh very likely we'll be getting some more fairly soon um so we do have four and of course uh valeria um, she's not saying much about the situation all right the other new individual we have is uh, alice here I named Alice after the Allosaurus in the old television series, uh, Land of the Lost. Not that 
movie thing. You can probably find him on YouTube or something like that. They call the Allosaurus Alice, so that's why I named her. And uh, did she just level again? Okay, she might be fighting Big Al for leadership. Uh, her stats are really terrible, though. I'm not really sure what's going on with that. But uh, we may have a breeding combination here I may work on the rest of the army with. So I have four Allosauruses, among other things. I am going to be taking them on the ground. See, here's the plan. Oh, and it looks like I'm dying of thirst. I, I just love that. The first... The first indication that I have of a thirst problem is that my character starts going like Conan. Like that. Kind of silly, I think. Um, anyway, the plan is going to be I am going to teleport Bernadette over there to the South Island. All right, hold it a second there. It's kind of I'm pointing towards it down there because I have a teleporter. I'm actually working on something. From then, we're going to fly to the... Um, the Scorch Earth area, and I'm going to be scouting it from the air. When I find an area that either I want to put a base down or I think it's a good staging area, we're going to land, drop a teleporter, going to bring her back, and then we're going to bring an attack force on the ground because that's what I want to do. That's why I have the Allosauruses. I'm not bringing the T-Rexes. The T-Rexes are basically going to be when I get to open desert and maybe we can kill some death worms, you know? So we'll see about that because that's kind of, uh, I think it's overkill and they might get stuck in like canyons and stuff like that. Uh, they are a little bit hard to manage, but if you're talking about open desert, that's kind of a different thing, right? And as I understand, there is open desert. I'm undecided, I think I'm going to ride Harriet because the thing about it is there are a lot of bugs in the desert and... Um, I think that would actually be useful. I'm thinking what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the Allosauruses. I'm going to ride Harriet. I'm probably going to bring Lance just as a wild card. I don't know if I want to bring Donna or not. I'm going to have to think about that. Anyway, we're going to just do what we're going to do here, right? And get on with this. All right, so... Wyverns are just so useful. As I said, there is no way I can go back for any more unless I kill them all. When I was out looking in the um, the snow area, I found the ice wyvern area, which I don't want an ice wyvern. They really they suck. Slowing down damage, I would rather I'd rather damage. Um, the thing is that as soon as I got near the opening, I'm like, oh, there's nothing there, and then all of a sudden, an entire mass just spawned. And there was like a dozen of them swirling around. And I was like, ah, I got to get out of here. And luckily, none of them saw me. But I mean, yeah, I mean, it's just kind of weird. And they're all over the place uh, in the other locations. So I have a, uh, a really good wyvern. I'm very happy with that. So, uh, sorry, I missed it. Hold on a second. Um, there we go. That's where I want. All right, we're going to South Island. I hope she's not in the water. There's not a lot of room nearby. Okay, wait there for a moment. All right, so this is what I've been working on, by the way. I've been using the river rock foundations here. So I have a rather large area. I put some rails there. Um, I might put bigger ones, especially when you have this fellow here who's really annoying. He's like level 200, but he's, he's freaking out now because there's a, a wyvern nearby. But I want to have um, docks on both sides, and I'm starting to put like, you know, fortifications underneath because I'm now over the water. See, over here, I could keep some creatures here because there's like a, a thing over there, um, a little gap. I might be able to get megalodons out of there. I don't know. I'm going to have to see about that. Okay, hold it up. Okay, up, up, up. There we go. And uh, over there is much deeper. So over here, so I'm going to have docks. That's what I'm planning. And I'm going to build like a, uh, a nice house here. It's not really for crafting. See, it's much deeper over here. So I can have larger things if I have them. All right. As a matter of fact, I'd like to look around from the air. Yeah, you're, um, he's 200. He's like freaking out. Well, you know, if you would get away from that platform, there wouldn't be a problem. Now, I think I saw... It may have run deep. Okay, so that's a megalodon, right? Yeah, 110. All 
All right. I thought I saw another one of those whales. The ones, the basilisk one that um, had all of the manta rays around it. I'm pretty sure I could handle the mantas with uh, Barbara. I wouldn't want to hit that thing, though. So if I find a situation, I might just do something like that. Keeping my eyes open. All right, so let's do this. Let's go to the desert. I'm wearing ghillie, but I just remembered now that I'm wearing fur pants. I hope that doesn't mean that uh, there's going to be a heating problem down below. All right, and this is... Okay, so here we are. All right, so we're just going to poke around a little and see what we see. Okay, it's all, like, faded. Does that mean it's, like, super hot? Probably. See, here's the thing. I don't know if this is, like, true scorched earth where the heat waves come in and such like that because, I mean... Does it do that to the entire map, or does it do it to areas? Because we certainly haven't seen any anywhere else. Is that a moth? Yeah, it is a moth, isn't it? Okay. See, that's where these guys need to be, over here. Okay, do we have gators down there? Yeah, we do, actually. Okay. All right, so far, this area is not conducive to what I would like to have done. It's, um... Uh, Not something I want to walk the Allosauruses through, you know what I mean? But it is a very large continent, so it's not that big of a deal here. All right, but we're just checking it out for now, seeing what's around, what isn't around. All right, what do we have here? Okay, so more moths. All right, since it is my first time over here, you can see that um, they're spawning in little groups. Okay, some metal over there. Okay, what do we have there? Thorny dragons? Ooh. That's a high level thorny dragon, huh? Okay, this is interesting here. Okay, is that red? It looks red to me. What do we got? I yes. Yes. So so very yes. All, all I saw was the epic chainsaw, because I have a primitive one. Um, I, is that a blueprint? That's a blueprint, right? Um, I don't need that one. Uh, flamethrower ammo? I'll hold on to that. Um, oh, wow, that is um, a lot better than the one that I have. A lot better than the one that I have. Very nice. And this is, oh, a rock golem saddle. I think they're around this area. I don't know about that. That's just, you have to get the catapult and yeah, that's just a big old mess right there. Oh, and I see a kangaroo. We have a kangaroo. All right. Oh, is that the desert over there? All right, hold it a minute. Maybe the drops are just better over here. It's all faded, though. Okay, what have you got? Can I see it? Okay, scorpions. Oh, okay, that's a little bit too far north. <laughs> the edge of the world. Yeah, well, I don't know. Maybe we be whipping out the T-Rexes or something around here. Oh, I see some runes over here. Ooh, Harriet would love that so much. So many tasty insects. What do we have over here? Oh, thorny dragons. And there is a big old fight taking place over there. Vultures! Vultures attack thorny dragons? Maybe the thorny dragon attacks a vulture? I don't know. Now this... Oh, what do you got here? Um... Okay, it's right, like, right on the edge. Okay, I wish they had taken the continent and moved it a little bit because it seems very thin around here, you know what I mean? Um, wait a minute. 
Okay, an oil pump. I just picked up an oil pump. Okay, another... Is that the... Oh, wait a minute. I found a canteen in the desert and it's full. Alrighty. Okay, so, so far, I like the drops around here. All right, there's no room for anything over here. So, is it scorpions? Scorpions. Hey, a bonsai tree! All right, let's just scout around here. All right, let's just do a quick stop, because I want to see how much I've actually covered at this point. Uh, not much, because it goes a lot further than that. All right. Oh, hey, what is down there? Okay, some moths. I wouldn't mind being near water, that's for sure. Mm, I was hoping that would be flatter. Because I, like I like the idea of being like up there, being near the water. All right, so I'm looking, okay, well this over here might be okay. Uh, wh wh what are you doing there? Aren't you supposed to be, aren't you supposed to be in the icy areas? Okay, I didn't know that they were in the desert too. Hmm, interesting. I mean, trying to train them in the icy areas is almost death because of everything that spawns there. But I mean, it would be a lot more manageable here, wouldn't it? I mean, what kind of hostile things are we seeing here? Um, is that a, an RG? Oh, there's an Argentavis over there? In the desert? Okay. Um, but I mean, I'm, look, I'm seeing raptors. I'm guessing you might see a Carno or something like that. The thorny dragons. We killed thorny dragons or something like that. That's interesting, though. Um, I don't know about... Uh, I mean, what levels are they? I'm wondering about actually landing there. All right, let's just take a quick look around and see what else. Okay, so that looks like open desert. Let's look around here. All right, I don't need a base area. I can just kind of land and then walk around. All right, what do you have? All right, you have a lot of stuff. I just saw something that I wanted. Oh, 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 guess what I didn't see. <laughs> what level are you? Where's the other one? He wants, he wants the preserving salt too, right? All right, hold on a minute. Hello. Nom 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 nom. Get off of my supply drop. Nom 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 nom. Okay, I like the drops. Okay, this one's about to vanish. All right, just grab all of it. Oh no no, not that, not that him. Um, I thought you ate him. All right. Hold on a second. Um, yeah, the preserving salts. Sand. I don't need to carry sand with me. I don't need that. Uh, silk. I need silk. That reminds me. I have to keep an eye open for silk. Um, hold on a minute. How did, I, how did I do that? Oh, no. I took all your stuff away from you, didn't I? That's, in other words, I looted him. Um, can you call him, carry the oil pump for me? If I see an oil spot, we can do that. Okay, uh, obviously I don't want to put anything here because this is a, um, it's an airdrop area, it's a supply drop. All right, um, I don't want the RGs bothering me. All right, I tell you what, why don't we put, when we put a teleporter down here, what are you? Oh. 
first of all, what are you doing here? Second of all, I'm going to be carrying you back with me. Yeah, I'm going to be carrying him back. I, I, I love those guys. I love those guys. I wasn't going to go crazy looking for them because I do have uh, Lance, who kind of does the same thing. But, I mean, these guys are great cats. I love them a lot. Um, so I'm going to stay away from him and remember where he is. And we're going to take him back. Yeah, I see a drop. It's almost blinding over here. Um, I don't see anything there that I want. Mantis. Is there any death worms around here? I don't see... Alright, what I want to do is I want to go back the other way. Alright, so why don't we put down a teleporter over here? Oh. Bugs. Man, he would. She, she would love to eat the bugs. Ankylos, Carnos. All right, let's find a nice spot. What do you have? Oh, that. Wait, 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 wait. Um. Adobe door frame. Nothing I want. Blueprints. All right. What is that shadow? Okay. All right. Let's just plop down over here. All right, this seems like an interesting area. Oh, we got scorpions, but that's not going to be a problem. All right, so let's just uh, do this quickly. I'll worry about naming it later. All right, we're just going to put this down here. This would be a good place for the uh, the T-Rexes to go to the, um, the desert anyway, right? All right, so boom. All right, you get over here. All right. All right. Let's uh, let's head back. All right. So let's see crafting base. I'm gonna be bringing Bernadette back here to get that. By the way, it, I mean I'm just gonna swoop down, grab it, and then fly it back. It's not exactly very exciting. Uh, it is gonna be a long trip, but you know, uh, wyverns are very good at long distance speed. And uh, stamina. All right, well, you sit there. Okay, let me uh, let me arrange this. Okay, I think we're all set. Uh, I've actually decided to take Donna instead of Lance. Uh, I mean, he's from the forest, you know. It just doesn't seem to make a lot of sense. I know she's from a frozen area, but you know, we. Uh, We've seen some weird stuff over there, haven't we? All right, so it shouldn't have a, uh, a name. All right, that one right there. All right, so let's go. All okay, up we go. And then J. Everybody should be following now, I think. There we go. All right, so let's see what we have going back this way. I'd rather stay out of the open desert. Oh, hi! How are you doing? Okay, I should probably turn this on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll probably poke out. Actually, oh, I see some more bugs. Alright, you know what? We're going to go out into the desert. We're just not going to go too deep because I don't want to run into a death worm without T-Rexes. Hey, how's it going? Num, 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 num. What do we have over here? Hold on a minute. All right. I forget. Was there something? No, I didn't want anything over there. Um, was that a vulture? I don't want to mess with a vulture. All right. I think, is that a, um, I think that's a water bug. Hold on a minute. Um... I think that's a water bug. All right, let's just go out and find some trouble. Okay, it's bug time. Oh, 
Okay, now here we go with real stuff. Num 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 num. Oh, except of course I forgot to level her, so why don't we do a little bit more damage? Because we're not doing anywhere near enough damage here, right? Num num num. Oh, is that always oh, a Titan bow? That was a Titan bow. Why would there be a bow in the desert? Uh, there's some weird stuff going on here, you know? Oh, this should be fun. Here, turn that off. Let's do this. All right, I don't want to mess with the vultures. What do we have here? What do we have here? Okay, I'm getting close to the cat, and I don't want to uh, mess with the cat. All right, I do see... Oh, there it is right there, actually. Boy, that's going to be easy to grab. All right, let's just move away from there. I don't want to mess with the cat. All right, I see a lot of things moving over there. Oh, oh, somebody leveled again. Um, actually, why don't we do a little bit of stamina there? Getting a lot of kite in there. Yeah, she's great at munching on them. All right. I wonder if any of these guys have to level. I'll take care of that later. Okay, you know what? Why don't we do it like this? Just like insta-killed. Oh, no, you know what it is? She has her buff on. She has her, her insect killing buff on. That's what that is. That countdown at the top. That's the reason she just hit that thing for a thousand. What? It says worm. Oh, that's actually not what I wanted to do, is it? All right, well, we're committed here now, right? Boom! Ollie killed a death worm. Okay, Ollie killed a death worm. Okay, turns out we don't need T-Rexes for this, do we? All right, where's Ollie? Um, Ollie... Okay, everybody's like leveling here. Except for you, right? Um, Ollie! Ollie got 10 levels! <laughs> Ollie got 10 levels for that. Okay, hold on a second. Did you get... Oh, you got leech blood. Okay, that's right. Organic pollen is coming from... Where's the leech blood coming from? Okay, some... Oh, you got the claw. All right, that's what I was looking for. The horn, I should say. Not a claw. Okay, so I was wondering who got that. You got that. Oh, pardon me. Um, we'll just give you a lot of damage. All right, you don't need that. You don't need that. And you don't need that either. All right, I should probably check everybody else. Alice has not leveled... Uh, Allie has leveled. We'll give you a little bit of that. Okay, you you have a lot of stuff. This is good. Big Al. Okay, Big Al, what have you been doing, dude? What are you doing here? You're not leveling. Okay, uh, I don't think you got anything. Right, you're just kind of... Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. You just leveled. So you are level... Just do that. All right, so you're level 400 now. All right, back over to here. Okay, so we got a death worm. Okay, his buff is worn off, by the way. I should say her buff is worn off. Num, 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 num. Now she's got the buff back. Oh, here we go. Whew. Now this is what she does when she's got her insect killing buff on. Come on, everybody! Go for the bugs. Hey, a purple centipede. More bugs. Oh, it's a centipede. Oh, oh no, pardon me. It was actually another Titan boa. Okay, so I think these guys are... Yeah, they're water bugs. They're nothing really to mess with, right?
I see some bugs. All right. Kill them. Kill them all. Yes, I don't even... Oh, no, no, mine, 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 mine. It's called desert depopulation. They're just falling out of the sky over there, aren't they? All right, where is... Boom, have some of that. All right, uh, drop that. You don't need that. Wow, that's a, that's a lot of prime meat there. And we're getting a lot of organic polymers, so we won't have to kill any uh, penguins for a while, right? Okay, why are there boas in the desert? I don't understand that. Just, that doesn't make any sense to me. I mean, it's a swamp jungle creature, right? Okay, uh, I don't want to attack the vulture. Vulture's not doing it. He's just doing his thing, right? I do need to keep my eyes open for some, uh... Is there anything over here? Oh, 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 bug. Bug. That looks like centipede. Yep, that's centipede. That's centipede. Kill him quick. Got 1,100 chitin from that centipede. Look at all that chitin. It's just the Megatherian is just an insane uh, collector of chitin. He's just amazing. In this case, she's just amazing. They need to bunch up more. It's their only chance for survival, isn't it? Hello? No, you cannot hide. You cannot hide. There is no hiding. No, there isn't. How far over are we? Hold on a minute. Oh, wow. There's still a whole bunch of uh, the continent left. We're not even halfway across. Okay, but I do think that that is enough for today. We had a, we had a good time. We got lots of materials here. And, of course, I have identified a, um, a new friend that I am going to deal with really quickly, indeed. I mean, it's a water bug. Just let it go. It has its use. In fact, maybe I should just get a drink quickly. Oh, actually, speaking of a drink. Anyway, I think that's going to be it for now. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to look around, maybe find a place to drop a base, or maybe what we can do is check out the rest of this place you know, basically from the air, and see if there's something better on the other side. Um, I didn't expect to run into a death worm, but we did, and, well, the team handled it really well, didn't they? Yes, they did. Tell me something, did you get anything? Hold on a minute. Oh, let me get, let me help. Okay, you did. You did. I'm really glad about that. Okay, that's good. That's good. I mean, I don't think we need the healing, because everything died so quickly. But uh, it was good that you contributed, Donna, because we want you to get that experience too. It's too bad they don't like share experience. You know, you can group them up and have them share or something like that. By the way, you got a level. And you got... You, oh, you got three levels. Okay, what did you kill that you got three levels? All right. Okay, and, uh, Ollie. Okay, and where is Allie? Okay, but I'm gonna have to collect all that stuff for them, but they're gonna have food for quite some time. Anyway, that's gonna be it for now. It's our first foray into the desert. We took out a death worm, and there may be a very, very stupid Carno coming in our direction. And... 
dinner is served in our most spacious dining cart. Oh! I didn't realize that you were doing the healing. Okay. I, I didn't realize you were doing that. Hold on a minute. How's your, how's your food? Okay, I don't... Maybe he detected somebody was hurt or something like that? I have no idea. But then again, I did raise their, um... Uh, their health levels, didn't I? Anyway, thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games, because games are fun. See ya.